Hey, everybody, meet my new friend, Smiles. There are things about Smiles that I like, and there are things about Smiles that I don't like. Things about Smiles that I like is that he has a big-ass inventory, and he picks up some pretty good loot, including cash. Things that I don't like about Smiles is he seems to get staggered pretty easily. He leaves the door to the trader open, and man, I have spent hundreds of dollars at the dentist trying to brighten my smile, and this motherfucker has whiter teeth than I do. All right, everybody, welcome back to Seven Days to Die. I'm the Bearded OG. This is Smiles, and this is also the Rebirth series, the normal Rebirth series. All right, uh, we have a lot to do today. Um, first thing I will tell you, and some of you may have mentioned this in the comments, but I have not seen those comments yet, um, is that if you combine um, four of the summoning skeleton warrior potions, you can make a permanent follower. So Smiles is actually a permanent follower, just like uh, Doom is. He's not just a temporary two minute um, thing that I throw out of the potion. Now I can also have um, a temporary Smiles at the same time and have both of them. What I can't have at the moment though, is I can't also have Doom out. Now, um, you know, I, I did of course a little joke thing at the beginning there, but um, Smiles has, uh, first of all, let me show you his inventory. He's got a huge inventory and he picks up cash and bullets uh, and other cool stuff too, man. I mean, he just picks them up, you know, as we're out in, in the world. Um, when I, uh, last emptied his inventory, he had over $300 of cash in there and ammo and some other cool stuff. So very cool. Lots of storage space. Uh, but as I, you know, <laughs> mentioned <laughs> that crazy opening there, uh, he does get, he does kind of seem to get staggered, you know, fairly easily. Um, and he does this weird thing, you know, when we go into the into the trader, he'll open the door, but then the door just starts opening and closing all on its own. It's really odd. So, yeah, um, when um, we get to the point where we have uh, a point uh, or, you know, we can get the charismatic nature, you know, then we'll be able to have both smiles and doom and also our temporary potion skeleton all at the same time. And I'm, I imagine when we get to Witch Doctor 4, um, we'll the skeleton zombie that we can have probably will also, you know, uh, will probably also be limited that way. But I'm assuming the skeleton zombie is, is stronger than smiles because, you know, we got smiles at level three. We'll get the skeleton zombie at level four. So very cool. Um, I have a few off camera things also to show you. Um, I went out and I did a whole bunch of wrenching, did not find a small engine, but I did find a, uh, I, I found two extra motorcycles. I took both of them apart and I had enough parts to put together a motorcycle. So we actually now have a motorcycle here. Um, I didn't, uh, I only uh, showed one of those motorcycles on camera because I wasn't, I, I wasn't recording when I did the first one, but yeah, we now have a motorcycle. Um, I wasn't intending to get a motorcycle, but I found the parts for the motorcycle. I did not find the parts for the mini bike. And if you're wondering why the hell would you want a mini bike over a motorcycle? I have a three letter word for you. It's called G and it ends with ass. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this thing's going to be a gas hog, which means it's going to be kind of a pain in the ass to to keep in the gas until we, you know, uh, get to the point where we can sustain our own gas. But, you know, I had it, it's got a full tank and, a, and I'm not going to just use it for every place that we go. Uh, if we're going to stay close by, we'll probably just stay on the bike. But, you know, for longer trips, we'll use the motorcycle. Uh, this is its inventory space. So it's I think that's about the same as it is in vanilla. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, so we got the motorcycle. Uh, but like I said, I still have not found a small engine, which is Spiles, don't hit my motorcycle. 
uh, which is a bummer because we need that for the cement mixer. And so what I was thinking about maybe doing is going back to that mini bike that I was going to fix up and wrenching it and see if I can get a small engine uh, from it. I don't know if I can or not. So, yeah, that's still a thing, and it's an important thing because I do not want to do the next horde night without concrete. So we've got to come up with a, a working cement mixer, uh, you know, before that point in time. I also uh, got the remember to go get the mercenary. And while Smiles and I were out uh, wrenching cars, uh, we got another uh, Death's Whisper boss attack, and it took me a million years to kill that guy because he was the armored, um, you know, the armored cop uh, boss, but I finally took him down. And we got a strength uh, injection uh, for our trouble uh, along with all that ammo. So we are now, we're almost actually to level two strength. If you guys are wondering why I'm not buying these books, I plan to, but um, I'm, I'm hanging on to my money until I decide if I'm going to spend that money on the missions to get the, um, the distiller and another one of these if we, if we don't find one. Okay, so the plan for today is to make armor. So I also gathered up all of the parts that we need to make a full set of bl level blue or level five athletic armor. So we're going to do that. Got a few more things also to take the trader. I found um, Freelancer in a car when I was out wrenching. So let's listen to that. Turn that down a little bit. Okay, cool. Uh, so we got that going. Um, how, how are we doing on the music, by the way? Okay, so we need three more for volume three. Looks like we need um, four more for volume two and three more for volume one. So, yep, it's coming along. All right, so let's go get this armor made. And then I think what we really ought to do today, I think, is, is do some trader quests. Because not only, you know, trader quests, right? But that's also what's going to level our charisma. And I would really like to get Charismatic Nature, which is another reason why I'm hanging on to my money. Uh, so we can buy that. And that way we can have Doom. Because here, oh, here's another thing about that Smiles can't do that Doom can. He can't use mind control. So he can't turn the bad bats like Doom can. So uh, I, I would really like, like I said, to have both of those dudes, um, you know, to be able to use them all the time, right? Okay, so yeah, we'll leave the motorcycle here for now just again because... Uh, I don't want to, you know, expend any gas if we don't have to, because it takes a very long time to wrench enough cars to fill that thing up. Uh, all right, yeah, so let's go over here to the workbench. And, you know, in the process of doing some trader quests, maybe we'll come across a tabletop stove and or a distiller and or a lootable workbench, etc. Right? Okay, let's do this. Gloves. Hat. Outfit. And Zapatos. Oh, man, those don't take long at all. Very good. Okay, while we're waiting for that, let's sell this stuff to um, Elias here. And I have a little bit of clay, so let's use that to make some more bullet casings. And then we need to go grind this doorknob. So, yeah, I figured that the, um, the athletic set is going to give us the most bang for our buck at this point in time because if you don't know its bonus is less food and water consumption man food and water is a pain in the ass in this mod in the beginning you know so i think that'll be you know coin well spent okay so let's put uh, all of this back in here and then look at that it's a beautiful thing okay so we want to take all of this stuff off and just by what happened to my music oh 
It, it yeah, we <laughs> duh, <laughs> we removed the Walkman. Okay, so this has four mod slots. This one has oh my god, twice as many mod slots. That's amazing. I I know why Ramsey did that though, because you know so many of the improvements that we get in the mod are 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 mods, right? And so. Yeah, that's very cool. Okay, so let's take all of this stuff off, um, and we'll do we'll do the hat first. So let's wear the hat, and then modify, and then we'll put all of this stuff back in. And now we have room for more things. Um, we could probably make a couple more mods too, uh, but let's let's get just take care of what we currently have, so I don't get confused here. Uh, all right, so we'll wear the outfit, and we'll take all of this stuff off. I did go back out to the desert for just a little bit too, um, mostly you know uh, looting cars. I and I found one or two more oil shale deposits, but I didn't mine them. All right, so that goes on there. Now let's wear the gloves, and we'll take the mods off of these gloves and put them on our new ones. Yeah, this is great, man. All of that extra mod, uh, those extra mod slots. It's a wonderful, it's a wonderful thing. Here, we'll just modify these right here. And then we will wear the shoes. Okay. So, um, it says athletic full set bonus active. And that here again is uses less food and water. Does it, t oh, Oh my God, 50% less? That is amazing. Holy shit. Is that what it is in vanilla too? I, I never actually used the athletic set in vanilla. Um, Wow. I'll take it. 50%. That's amazing. <laughs> All right. That is a very nice improvement, man. Very, very nice improvement. Okay, good. Um, I suppose we should probably hang on to, to this ranger set as a backup armor set. Um. I don't know. When we died, did we keep our armor? I don't. I don't remember. I don't remember. Okay, let let's go. Uh, let's go talk to Rect and get some jobs. And we're gonna we're gonna spend the rest of this episode doing some Stop jobs. Staring asshole. All right. So what? Okay. Here's a warehouse that has a chance to maybe have a cement mixer. A mixer. Alone Residence, Holiday Street, Department of Transportation, Moe's Grocery. Okay, Department of uh, Transportation is east of here. Um, so let's Look take that. Kid, I'll give you some work, but you well, actually, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Let's go back to... Where was that? Uh, oh, they, they changed. Shit. Okay. <clears throat> um, we could also just do residential houses because those have a chance, you know, for the hot plate with kitchens. Um, I don't think the Motel 7 would have those necessarily. The Simmons Shanty, 21 Holiday Street, Old Cemetery, a pass and gas, and abandoned shady shed farms. Crap, man! I wish the I wish that wouldn't have changed because I was gonna take that warehouse one. Well, okay, well let's let's do this. Let's re recycle it again. Yeah, okay. Quonset warehouse. That's to the southwest. And there's a home street. There's a Russell Circle. A Wilshire Lane. I think those are probably gonna all be. What is kickflips? I don't know. Okay, let's just let's take this warehouse. Better take this job. I'm not in the mood for any more of your bullshit. I wonder though, is this the one that has the mushrooms and the crop plots? I mean, if if it does, we could get those. Okay. So there's Mopo Shack, the Kinvan Residence, Gentle Pony, Bows Market, John John John's by F and S. John John's. Uh, we're going southeast, right? There's a Moe's Grocery. That, mm, I don't know if that would have it or not. I mean, any of them could potentially have it. There's that Department of Transportation again. 
Name's not important. All right. What is important is if you have the balls to Okay, help let's me just take problem. let's just take those two. And I am going to buy this. But now, you know, now of course that food and water is going to last so much longer. So we'll do these first two jobs. Now remember that see that's what I'm talking about. See how the doors just open and close? That's because of smiles. Dude, what the hell? Okay. Um right. Okay. So let's go uh, back to the base, drop this uh, the spare armor off, grab something to eat to top off, and I, th I think I'm absolutely going to love the fact that we consume 50% less food and water now. That was so worth it. And, you know, we could, we could look and see just real quick. I, I don't want to get, like, I don't want this episode to be like the last episode in terms of how much, I, how much squirreling I did. That was ridiculous, even though at the end of the day... <laughs> At the end of the day, some pretty good stuff happened, right? But still, it's like, that was just a bit much. Um, okay, so anyway, let's let's come up here. And um, we want to drop off this armor here. Uh, so for mods... Uh, oh, look at that. Let's do another one of these. What is this? This is uh, ranged expertise. Tacticals. Let's do it. I'm looking for, like, the Collis jacket in the tennis shoe. Oh, I got a bunch more armor in here, too. Okay, my inventory is such a clusterfuck right now. But I don't care. I mean, I do care because it, it's hard to find stuff, but I it will be fixed. I promise. I know. I keep saying that, huh? Oh, here we go. Okay. So we can make mods from these. Um, this, what will this do? Recipes. Running stamina regen. I'll take that. Um, to, we need five. Okay. So we'll do that. And then th what does this do? This gives us running speed for five. Um, okay. So let's put that back and we'll put that back. And let's just eat this shepherd's pie. And that'll probably get us just about topped off. And maybe I'll take an extra bacon and eggs just in case it doesn't. And then um, let's drink. One of these for now. And we'll save the other one. Okay, let's go make these two mods and then we're going to head out. And we are going to take the motorcycle this time because we need the storage space. All right, cool, man. This armor set's amazing. Okay, so now watch this. I'm going to close the gate. He's going to come through it. I mean, what the hell? <laughs> uh, Ramsey, are you even aware of that? <laughs> anyway, okay. Um, let's go recipes. Oh, no, we got to do this in the forge. Yeah, right, okay. Our running speed tier and stamina regen tier. Tier one, but hey, the thing about tier one is when you find another one, then you combine them to make tier two. So I like that system. That's really nice. Oh, we need to read this as well. So if we look at, oh, let's see, witch doctor and assault rifles. No, witch doctor. Tactical rifles. So, okay, so we're at 20.34. This should put us at 30.34. Look at that. It's a beautiful thing. Okay, nice. Uh, doesn't look like we have... I, I gotta... Man, I gotta go do some mining. There's so much to do. Uh, all right, so this goes on feet and this goes on feet. So let's modify these and put those on. This is going to give us a 2% running speed. Not that beautiful, but later on, you know, it'll stack and we'll get better. And this will give us a little bit of stamina regen while running. So it's better than kicking the balls. It's a start. It is indeed a start. Okay. You're not a bad guy, are you? No, that's Lincoln. I have no idea who Lincoln is, except for that it's that guy. 
Okay, so, um... Wait a minute, why do I have three quest markers? Oh, I do have three quest markers. I forgot about this laundry one. Um, okay, let's do that one first. I think that was probably closest anyways. What I was about to say before I squirreled myself again is that I do have the setting turned on that could get us an infested quest and we won't know until we do it. Oh, I bet you those are the Quonset huts right there. Well, are they? I don't know. I know that the the laundry place is just right across the street from the tool store here. All right, let's go here. Uh, make this the active quest. Oh my god, look at that. Take both of those things. Copper. Oh, I found, uh, I got a wooden bow too off of a, a bandit. In fact, I got two wooden bows off of a bandit. So, got a little upgrade there too, just when we were out and about doing our thing. Let's check this. Oh, very good. Okay, we can sell that. We'll pick up this. Oh, I wonder if we're going to have like a whole shit ton of washing machines in here. I mean, you know, laundromat, right? Uh, should we see if there's any... Yeah, let's cheese a couple of things here. Chicken soup. Any chance that works? Okay, we're going to wrench that and then maybe the new one will work. And it'll give us another drink machine. And we also have an ATM as well. Leave smiles alone. Leave my bike alone too, please. I don't think smiles is as tough as um, Doom either. He's got he's got high hit points, but I don't think he has as much armor as Doom. I could be mistaken though. I don't know. And by the way, Doom does not get staggered either. Uh, at least I don't think he does. Um, so yeah, there's that. But hey. You know what? Smiles has his, his his strong points, right? That smile. Damn. Makes me jealous. Got it. $356, make you holla. I guess I should probably wrench this car, too. Um, I don't... I don't know if we can get a small engine from a normal-sized vehicle or a, you know, car-sized vehicle. I did, I have, um, you know, gotten a few of them on the purse, but I just don't remember how I got them, you know. I would assume that mini bikes, go, you know, the little go-kart thingies, that sort of thing, uh, probably would net you a small engine, but there's not a lot of those things around. So, yeah, that's the thing. Ooh, brass. For those of you who are a little bit newer to watching me play Seven Days to Die, I kind of have a rule about double looting. I let I let myself double loot stuff outside of the building, but I don't ever go in and hit like the main loot and then come out and start the quest. That's just my own personal rule. And that way I can sleep better at night, right? Very important that you sleep good at night. Okay. Smiles, you want to take care of this guy, please? You took care of him. Looks like we might have a bandit over there. Yeah, we do. Uh, he's got a... Oh, he's got a spear. Okay. Let me loot, please. There we go. 
hardly worth hanging on to. It could be completely my imagination, but it seems like our titanium scythe here has a little more reach than the sickle. It looks like it does. Um, do I want this for any reason at all? It doesn't sell for very much. Well, okay, I guess we'll hang on to it for now, but we need to get rid of something, you know. You know the drill. And let's just check his inventory. Yeah, see, look at all that stuff, man. Um, I've, I don't re ever recall Doom picking up cash or bullets. He picks up the genetic blueprints and, you know, the more organic stuff, but I, I don't ever remember him picking up bullets, which is really cool. I'm digging it. And uh, we can even... Hmm, no, I think we only had two more of these, but hey, we're well on our way, right? You know what? Let's actually just have him hang on to this stuff for now, since he's looting it anyways. Okay, let's get started. I know, I'm dilly-dallying. What else is new? Okay, we got more food out of that dumpster. Very nice. Did this reset? It did not, but this did. Uh, okay, choke mod. Or no, duck bill mod, rather. I actually kind of like the duck bill mod on the shotgun. It doesn't suck. That does not work, which means we can loot it. Or, sorry, not loot it, but uh, salvage it for more good parts. Let's also hit these once again. $255, make you holla. Holy shit, 5,000 hit points? Nah, you know what? I don't want to take time to do that right now. Oh, all right, so I think this is where we start, and I'm also, in case we get an event, which we very likely will, uh, we're going to break off this ladder so as long we can retreat to the roof if we have to. See, two red dots. All right, let's just get ready to turn them. Come over here, Granny, and kill this guy. Or I'll do it. Guess I didn't need to loot that. Uh, okay, let's wrench these. Did she fall off? Yeah, she did. What is this? This is a clear. Okay, so we have to kill her. Uh, didn't get a radiator there. Bummer. Okay, come on down here. Um, smiles, and let's take her out. Titanium Scythe Quality 2. Whoop. Okay, try that again. There we go. Uh, all right, so does that mean... It just means that we, we got the the crafting. We leveled it on the crafting, but not on the witch doctor. Right. Okay, cool. Yeah, we'll probably just stick with the level one until we can make a, a green or a blue. Oh, shit. We got to go down there. Really? I hate, I hate those drop-down quests. Oh, man. All right. That's nice. Some 762s. Okay. Well, let's get this ready to go. Um, actually, let's get this ready to go. And I think I'm also... Oh, no. You know what we could do? If, if we get rushed, I can just do the AOE on this guy. Yeah, okay. Here we go. We're good. All right. 
Back to plan A. Uh, I see two red dots. So I'm going to say this is probably not an infested. There's probably somebody in that closet area there. All right, we got a jiggly. Oh, now they're at nightmare speed. Well, she's not at nightmare speed. Oh, shit. Okay, so she came out of there. Alright, I don't think these guys will have a, an easy way to get in here. You know, one thing we should probably do, though, is... Let's, let's remove that. And what I want to do is put that there. So if we need to quickly pull up, we can do that. Okay. All right, let's check all of these. I think we looked at one of these for selling. I don't remember what it was worth. 19? Okay. That's not too bad. Let's get uh, these other ones looted. Hey, what the hell happened there? God damn it. Oh, keep in there. I, I got to remap that button. I got a thumb button on my new mouse, and when I hit it, it tabs me out. It totally fucks me up, man. Oh. So even when that guy's our buddy, he can still poop out little minis. I don't like that idea. Okay. Are we good? Oh, rebirth. Cheaty, cheaty, cheaty. That's what you get for re getting reborn. Without asking my permission. Okay. Uh. Is there a, a thing down here? No. Well, I don't think so. I think that's just painted as a as a dealio. Uh. Oh no, we can't pick that up. All right, let's pick all these other ones up. We'll loot this, pick it up, and the computer. Kind of hard to hit them. All right. You know what? Here. You kill him. And then I'll deal with you later. Are you guys fighting each other? What the hell? Nice. We clear otherwise? I think so. All right. You stay there. Well, actually, hold on. Let's go to this other room first and also pick all of these up.
Um, Smiles, keep an eye on that guy. He's going to turn back in a second. Please and thank you. Okay, we've got a backpack here. Um, can you find anything at all in toilets? I I, be, I believe Ramsey removed jars of water from toilets. I mean, we can loot him, but it doesn't seem like I ever get anything out of him. I mean, I just need to pay a little more attention. Get him, Smiles. I think that guy's maybe just slightly too tall to get in here. Guy's so hard to kill. When he, especially when he was that boss. Oh my god, he was hard to kill. That fight took me about ten minutes, you guys. I, I only showed you a few seconds of it, but it took me about ten minutes. I kid you not. Uh, all right, let's get ready with this. What the? What the hey, man? All right, I see three red dots. That's not too bad. Oh shit! Can you stay out here and help me with Big Mama? Well, if she can get over the fence, that is. All right, Smiles is going to go hit Big Mama. Okay, let's do you next. You did? He's stuck, too. Um, oh, that's it. Okay, we're done. Very nice. Okay, I do want all this cloth because it took me quite a while to farm up all the cloth to make all this armor. And I imagine um, later on we're going to want to make probably medium or even heavy armor. So cloth is pretty precious. And we're grabbing all of it. We need that stuff, too. We'll pick up any of the... Okay, that's damaged. Let's wrench this for brass. A laundry basket with some 7.62s, because that's what you put in laundry baskets is 7.62 caliber ammunition. Everybody knows that. That's all hide and armor kits. We need to replenish our armor kits after making all that armor, so that's good to get. Uh, I'll check this. Those are just zombie closets, I think. What is this? I don't know. Actually, not worried about it, to be honest with you. Take this. A Twinkie. That gives us Rampage, which I believe doubles our damage. And if we... Oh, shit. I didn't want to do that. I was going to pick it up, but whatever. Um, if we continue to get, I think, headshots within a certain period of time, then it adds five seconds per headshot or something like that. So we might make use of that at some point in time. Right. Ammo pile. Chair to wrench. Computer to pick up. Desk to loot. There's another flashlight. Took us a while to find that first one. Now we'll probably find them left and right and center and up and down. You know, that's how it goes, right? Let's open up the pass and gas. Come on, small engine. That is not a small engine. Damn it, Jim. We'll pick this up. I guess we'll pick this up, too. And we are pretty encumbered right now. But our bike's just out here. And, you know, if we got rushed, I can always just drop the backpack if need be. Which is a very nice feature of this mod. Oh, shit.
Okay. Um, there's our boss. Um, smiles. Oh, I want you to chillax for a second. Let's do this. Let's grab our potion. And oh, how did you get up here? Oh shit! I was. Hey, knock it off. I was trying to throw that. Okay, let's try that again. Really? That's all? Just one? All right. Oh, now the boss is pushing me. I need to turn more normal Zeeks to fight him. We got the one. All right, you know what? Resume. Go ahead. Go after him, Smiles. And let me give you a buddy, too. All right. At least he's not like a super serious armored boss. All the other Zeeks are inside of the... Inside of here. They're not behaving. Um, all right, let's actually heal up here. Okay, we just reached uh, medium armor. Got it. Trying to get a, a better angle here. There we go. There we go. See, we let we let all the minions, you know, soften the boss up, and then by the time they're dead, the boss is well softened up. He wants a piece of me though. Where are you guys fighting? Go after the boss. Get the boss, man. Get the boss. I don't think he's going to be as hard to kill as the other one was. Let's put a couple rounds into his noggin. All right, here. Let's try this again. How many did that turn? I don't know. Oh, two. Okay, it turned at least two of them. Okay, Smiles is at about half health. Oh, we got him. Hot damn. All right. Wow, he was so much easier to kill than the other guy. What is that? Melee damage. Okay. And a DNA dexterity boost. Jiggly, what are you doing? Come over here. Hey, don't make me waste arrows. Since you're stuck, I'll kill you. Oh, shit. What the hell? Oh. When you guys see that pause on my screen, that's me hitting that fucking thumb button that keeps screwing me up. Gotta remap it. Um, actually... Oh. Okay, let's just kill this guy. And then he's stuck. So, yeah, Smiles, Smiles isn't bad. I mean, he can fight. He just, like I said, seems to get staggered sometimes. And, which, and like I said, I don't remember Doom ever getting staggered. Oh, I 
that's not what I meant to do. All right, I think we successfully uh, killed that boss and completed that event, got the loot. Oh, Smiles is down. Okay, shit. He'll just, he'll just go back to our bedroll, and he will keep all, of, all the inventory, too. Found that out the hard way. Whew, okay. That, that was, uh, that was fun. <laughs> um, let's go get Smiles. Because uh, remember, my bedroll's actually at the, the Horde base. We'll go grab him. We'll go home, drop some stuff off. Um, it takes him a little while to heal. I can use bandages on him, but... Uh, let me see. Where am I going? Yeah, he's right there. Okay. I can use bandages on him, but I kind of need to save those for me. Because I'm a selfish bastard that way. I've already looted these. Yeah, I have. Yeah, oh. Shit. Really? God damn it. Sprain leg. Story of my life. Okay, can I get up here and then get up here and then up here? Oh. <laughs> I need to I need to just fill this in. Or at least uh, put that there. Okay, there we go. Okay, buddy. Back to life with you. Uh, Smiles. Where's Smiles at? Oh, you know what? I think there might be a cooldown before he can actually pop back in. Um. Okay, while we're waiting for him... What? Okay. What does it say? Why does it say he's down here? I can't call him to me. That's weird. Can I pick this up? Ooh. I can. Nice. Okay, we'll use that to store our guns in later. Not that we have lots of different guns, but... All right, let's see here. I What did we get? We got uh, this. So this is a hand slot, and it's 3% entity damage with melee weapons. That's, that's not terrible. That's not terrible. I'll take it. Nice little find there. And we got another of these, because the few times, or a couple of times I've gone to the desert, I do get hot. So temperature does work in Ramsey's mod. It just doesn't work in vanilla, at least last I knew. Ah, uh, shit. Okay, and then... That's, wait a minute. Why does Smile show up on my toolbar as if I'm controlling him? But I it I'm hitting the button and he's not he's not coming to me. Do I have to pick this up and put it back down? But it must just be a cooldown thing. I guess. I don't know. I mean, the map shows him over here. He is down there. Okay, what does the red uh, skull thing on him mean? Does that mean he's on cooldown? That's really weird. Okay. Let's do this. Let's head on back down and try not to fuck up our leg any more than it already is. Um, I guess I could take a steroid, but that's going to make us thirsty. Uh, oh, yeah, don't... S no, that's okay to spam those. I think you have to... You, if you take a healing item, you have to wait till it's below 10 seconds left before you can take the next one or something like that, I think. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe not. All right. Let's come back down here. Uh. Where 
just gonna go down here. Oh, I hit that button again. It's gonna get me killed, man. Oh! God damn it. Alright, can I... Okay, you get shot in the nuts, and now he's got me completely pinned in. Alright, you know what? Let's go this way. Oh, I don't want to fall down there, though. There we go. Okay, let's go back over to... Smiles. Let's see if we can figure out why he's derping out. Uh, he was right over here, right? Smiles, where are you going, dude? Oh, shit. What is he doing? And what's that red skull mean? Hmm. I don't, I, I don't know. I don't understand what's going on there. Ah, okay. Okay, guys, help me kill Big Mama. Now? What's Granny doing? Edgar, you got an arrow sandwich there, man. Okay, give me my arrows back. And stay out of my personal space, please. Alright, let's just... Let's go back over here. Uh, it's like he's going back to where he died? Usually, though, you see it... Hmm, maybe... Did he not die? I don't know. I'm confused. Because usually when they die, they leave their uh, their backpack on the ground, right? At least that's the way it worked with Doom. See, I can't talk. Uh, oh. Report for duty. Yes, I want Smiles to report for duty. Okay. Smiles. Halt. What in the actual F is he doing? Alright, let's just go back over by the laundry that's where he appears to want to go now what's he gonna do yeah he's like completely bugging out man okay this is right it's like he's okay are you done don't look at me that way Resume. There sure are a lot of boogers in this mod. Uh, all right. Are we done with the shenanigans, Smiles? Let me see your inventory, by the way. Uh, look at that. He's got 409 bucks. Damn. That's awesome. Okay, let me... Let me take all of your ammo and your money. 
And then I'm going to give you some other things that we're, that we'll take back home. That's a murky water. Yeah. Uh, no, anything that we can sell, I want to keep with me. Uh, I'll probably just sell the bicycle wheel too. Okay. That's good enough. All right, let's go back to the trader for the turn in and sell this stuff and uh, yeah, I, I I think we're gonna have to wrap up the episode, guys. It just, that took way longer than I was <laughs> planning, but we will continue to to do quests. Um, let's see, what's it's day 19, 20. Yeah, we we really got to find a cement mixer, man. I I don't. I, I mean, I know I can do another horde night over that pit and probably be safe, but it's just it's kind of boring for one thing. Um. And I'd rather fight them in our in our other, you know, that other cage that we made. But I don't want to do that. Well, I mean, I guess we could still do it with cobble as long as I block the back off so they can't get behind us like they were starting to do. I don't know, we'll figure it out. But really would like to get cement. Even if we found a cement mixer, we could leave it in place and just use it as is and not not pick it up, at least until after Horde Night. You know? Okay, let's do an ammo exchange. 36762s. Okay, that's pretty good. And then we'll also sell to you. So right now we have 5806. And now we have 6243. Pretty good. Pretty darn good. Um, all right. So, well, uh, let's go. Yeah, let's go do the turn in. Hi, Lincoln. Yeah, didn't we agree your first job was going to be free? Damn, this is all I can spare. 45762s is nice. But it'd be nice to get a big, one big antibiotic too. Let's do it. All right, more jobs. I know we still have two other jobs we got to do too, but I want to know what this John John's if you is. If want a job from me, you'll do what you told, asshole. Okay, let's do. Let's. I, I'm just curious. I don't know what the hell John John's is, so we're gonna find out. All right, ladies and gents, that is gonna be it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share out the video, and Smiles and I will catch you in the next episode. Say goodbye, Smiles. He said goodbye.